All right, so I've got my um, electromagnet here um, that I made from Ed Leeds Gowan's book, Magnetic Current, and uh, this has got 1,500 turns of 16 gauge wire, the uh, inch and a half round bar that uh, really should be square, and um, coils are about eight ohms together. The start of this coil connected to the end of this coil and that's connected to the positive these two batteries but you can see the voltage is only 11.8 volts now these these two batteries are just about had it um, I've got the negative just sitting here and I'm going to tap that on there and what I'll do is I'll take this 25 pound weight and I'll sit it up under there and I'll magnetize it to there and we'll see what happens so um, I'll just set the camera up and I'll get that ready to go so I've got some marks on Got some marks on there where I've tested it before. And I'm just going to try to get it in position. And then I'll tap the negative here. And you can see it holding there. So while the battery's, while it's connected here, the magnet holding up the, um, the uh, weight here but um, you'll see once we disconnect it I'm just going to move my meter there you go so that's um, 25 it actually weighs 23 pounds because I made these myself I got someone to cast them, so they're 23 pounds. But uh, now there's no no work being done there, so that's just all the the rope. The rope's doing all the work now, and the uh, the beams. So technically, no work's being done now. But if I connect the battery up again, uh, I connect it up. Oops. So now connect it up. Some work has to be be done because there's only you see there, there's only two volts there now across there. So current's running in the coils now and the magnet's working but if we if we disconnect it it doesn't make any difference whether the current's running or not but technically no work's being done there all the work is in the rope so it's just an interesting part of science and they'll stay there forever as long as you don't disturb it and uh, you can see that this is painted as well so it's actually gripping gripping through the paint there So there you go. I've seen a few videos on YouTube of some smaller versions, so I thought I'd show you a, a bigger version and uh, how it can actually just sit there as a magnetised state. But also, you'll notice um, it's not it's not magnetic. 
anymore. Like it won't hold any. It won't hold anything. Like it won't. It won't hold a, a washer or a paper clip. It's just basically all the the flux is running. You know, pointed across, and um, it's just all contained within the magnet. So there you go, Ed Lead Scalman's PMH holding 23 pounds.